Hi, I'm Sam, and I'm a first year electronics student at the University of Southampton. In this experiment, we're looking at capacitor discharge. This can be found in the bottom left corner of your music mixer board. On the board, there are two capacitors and four resistors. This allows us to change the value of the capacitance and the discharge resistance. There are two modes controlled by this switch here. Charging mode, which connects the capacitors to power and allows them to charge, and discharging mode, that connects the capacitors to ground via the resistors, causing them to discharge. In order to observe the discharge across the capacitor, we've connected this voltmeter to the test points. This allows us to look at how voltage changes over time. There are three different ways to connect the capacitors in this circuit. In this example here, we've got one capacitor. In this example, we have two capacitors in series. The jumper connects across them. And in this example, we have two capacitors in parallel with two jumpers just going downwards. So with your chosen capacitance connected, your voltmeter connected, and also one of the resistors hooked up like that, um, we're ready to start. To begin with, make sure the circuit is set in the charging mode and then switch the power on. You'll be able to see on the voltmeter that the voltage across the capacitor is now 5 volts. When you're ready to measure, switch the circuit to discharge mode and you'll see the voltage start to decrease. As part of the experiment, we want to take regular voltage readings at certain time intervals and this will allow us to plot a nice exponential decay. Once we've observed how the capacitor discharges, we can see how changing resistance affects the decay. To change the resistance, we need to move the jumper from one resistor to the next. Once we've collected our results, we can calculate the value of things such as the time constant by plotting the log of the voltage over the initial voltage against time and taking the gradient. Thanks for watching, I hope it's been helpful.